My name's Jean. David Tizard. My name's Sarah Hall. Eddie Matthew. And my name's Karen Levy. Uh, my name is Susan. Hi, I'm Carol Stevenson. I'm Pauline. I'm Vaughan Claire. My name is Alastair O'Key. My name's Fiona and I live in Cliftonfield. And I live in Bane Valley. No, I don't live in Margate, I live in uh, Broadstairs. I don't live in Margate, I live in Westgate, which is further around the coast. I live in Broadstairs. And I live in Margate. Yes, I've lived here all my life. No, I moved from Margate. I've lived in Margate since 1995. I moved down here. What I like about Margate is the fact that um, it's, it's got nice beaches. It's pleasant to go for walks during the summer. Um, obviously, Margate has its big event, which is the air show. Margate. Um, it's all right, because I like the uh, clock tower in Margate. Uh, the harbour, um, St Paul's Church, not really a lot else. Um, Cliftonville Seafront's doing okay lately, because it's had a revamp and that. I like the fact that it's become quite an arty place, I like all what's happening in the old town, how it's progressing and how the little retro shops are opening and um, which is of quite an interest to I think people in their 30s maybe. I like art in Margate because it's better and live Margate it's better. With all this art going on it's getting back up again. I like all the art down here. What I like about Margate is it's coming up again, it's being re regenerated and uh, I've come here with my partner and we always go around walking around and looking at the lovely buildings. There's some lovely uh, architecture in Margate and very varied as well. And we're very pleased that the Turner Centre is open now, even though there's not too much in it at the moment, but it's, being, it's bringing different people to the area. And uh, look at, they look, people look around the old town when they come to the Turner Centre and they can see what Margate has to offer. All right, it's just not a lot in there. But I like what they're doing with the children in there. What are they they, doing? Take, they take school children in there to do fun days and stuff. But I'm very pleased that the, um, the Turner Centre's come because I'm hoping it's going to bring a lot of trade here and business, you know. It's going to be nice to go on. They've got a restaurant that looks out over on the sea. There's lots of people, shops. The shops are good in Cliftonville. Um, they've got a very nice art shop. Well, I've buy all my art things from Lovelies. What do you like about Cliftonville? There's shops there, loads of shops there. Another like that I've got is the fact that along the cliff top here you've got like the crazy golf course where you can take the family, you can go and have a game of crazy golf with the kids. You've got the, the play park up there. Going on the beach and seeing I love going singing in the scene, I think. I love walking along the promenade, um, seeing all the caves and rooftops. Play, I like the places and I like the beach, very lovely beach. And I love all the cafes where we meet, especially the art class. There's a cafe in Cliftonville, we all go for coffee after art. Well, a lot of us do, and it's a very friendly place. We all chat. Um, Westgate's nice, it's very quiet, um, but there's, it's got its own shops and post office and everything. And um, it's got a very nice church. Um, and the beaches are very nice. And there's plenty of cafes and pubs. And it's quite good on the Signet Railway because you, they go up very slowly. And when they come to the hill, going down, they go down very fast and then back up again. I like that about that. You've got a lot of people in Margate, Cliftonville, Palm Bay. It's a friendly area. Oh, the beach is lovely. The beach is um, beautiful sand, much nicer than some uh, places where there's a shingle. Um, and I think it's got a lot to offer, Margate. It's, uh, 
it's, as I say, it's coming up. I think that more people are, are coming here and buying up, uh, buying up properties. Uh, I come from London and we find that the uh, properties are much cheaper here. You can get much more for your money. Uh, uh, we've got a very big uh, Victorian house. And uh, that's, uh, we, like, we like that. Uh, and also the people are very friendly, <laughs> we find. A lot of people are very friendly. And what I don't like about it is how it's got run down to what it used to be. Like, for instance, Cliftonville is virtually all charity shops and estate agents. It used to be beautiful shops they've taken away now. When I first started coming here, I was probably 30-odd, and Dreamland was going. And there was generally a bustle about the town. It's gone now. It's dead. Margate, it's, it's not like it used to be. How's that? Because the Margate that I know used to be people coming down from London, see all about Margate and everything like that. But since it's gone drifted, it's gone downhill. Well, I'm sad about the streets where the hotels used to be bright and nice. Uh, they've got very run down and people aren't perhaps got the money to do them up. So they've, they've got a bit run down. Well, they shouldn't have put the money on the Turner Centre. It should have gone in the Dreamland. Not the building itself, the actual money to bring Dreamland back because that would have brought people back into Margate. Because... Uh... We've got a certain uh, thing that's just been rebuilt called the uh, White Elephant. That's the new Turner Centre and it's a right eyesore for Margate. Because what I've heard is the fact that there isn't a lot of stuff in it. If they're building an art gallery, it needs to be full of stuff for people to look at. And from what I've heard, there's like three pictures in one room and things like that. The bad points is the fact that you've got people walking around um, drinking alcohol on the streets, which I really disagree with, because um, it, it's bringing it in. It's it's making the younger children see this, and they're gonna, you know, they're gonna take it into their heads that they can do it. The streets that are not clean enough. They. Young kids that run around at night getting drunk and they're not doing anything about them. Um, what I don't like about Cliftonville is people drinking on the streets, um, walking around Cliftonville and treading in dog smoke, which isn't right. People been drinking down the beach or people sitting drinking. Swearing at people. I don't like to see bags of rubbish being left on the streets. Um, sometimes when I've walked up Cliftonville in the evening or at night, I've seen uh, black sacks sitting outside shops or outside houses on the pavements. Do you like the sea? No, I don't go in it. Because it's too dirty. And uh, it's always... Um, Put like sewage in it and all that. Well, in a word, it's dilapidation. Uh, it's it's not a, an interesting place to shop in. It's not an interesting place to walk around anymore. It just doesn't have the pool. What I don't like is, I suppose, the shops that are uh, closed down at the moment. But there's every time we walk around, there's something opening up. So. There is a hope, uh, I think, in Margate. Um, but I think things are getting brighter. 